There. That's the last of them, little red tractor. And now, off back home for a spot of lunch. Where's Dan and little red tractor then, Patch? Hmm, not telling, eh? Or maybe you can't tell. Perhaps they've gone on a secret mission and you've been told not to say anything. How exciting! Ooh. What are they doing? You can tell me. I won't snitch. Honest. Stan, Little Red Tractor, where have you been? Was it a really big adventure? Oh, not really. It's something I do every year, bringing the straw in. Oh, but Pat said that... I mean, um... Mum asked if you'd like to come over to us for tea. We'd love to, wouldn't we, Little Red Tractor? <laughs> Just as soon as I've got these bales unloaded. By the way, where's Ryan today? Oh, he's gone for a run with Dad and Thomas. I didn't fancy it much. Not surprised. Here, we'd better take some straw for your mum. What for? Aha, uh -huh. she'll tell you. Come on, you two, or the ghost of Tawny Arnwood will catch you up. Ghost? What ghost? There's an old folk tale that says there's a ghost in Tawny Arnwood supposed to guard the Tree of Life. Tree of Life? What's that? There, over there. When the moon shines its light on the leaves of that tree, gather them up quickly, cos they've got the power to stop you growing old. But you've got to be quick or the ghost will get you. At least that's how the story goes. Come on, quick, before it spots us. A ghost? Wow! So that's why Stan brought the straw. That's right. Corn dollies. I make them every year, don't I, Stan? That's right. What's it for? It's an old country custom. You weave straw from the last sheaf of the harvest into a shape like this, and it's supposed to mean that you'll get a good crop next year. Of course, it's probably just superstition. Uh, yes, <clears throat> just like the ghost of Tawny Elwood. Wood. You mean... <sighs> you mean it's just a story? The ghost? Of course it is. No such thing as ghosts. But there is such a thing as cheese and pickle sandwiches. Time for tea, I think. <laughs> yes. Stumpy! Be careful! Uh, oh, sorry, Elsie. A uh, bit of an accident. You're the accident, Stumpy. Now get after my sheets and stuff. And when you've found them, you've got some washing to do. Righty. <laughs> Oh, Stumpy. Thanks for the tea. And thanks for the corn, Dolly, Mrs. Turvey. <laughs> Bye, 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 Can't understand how it happened, Walter. Big Blue just ran out of diesel. Yeah. You know, I always think the fuel gauge is a help when you want to know how much you've got in the tank. I can't keep an eye on everything, Walter. I'm a very busy man. Oh, of course, Mr. Jones. There. Uncle Jasper. Ah, Thomas, just in time. Your mum and dad will be here to collect you soon. Look, Mr. Toby's made you a corn dolly. A dolly? What do I want with a... Yeah, 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 all right. Yeah, yeah. I, I mean, it's, that's very nice of her. We can hang it in the barn. Here. Hi, Mr. Walter. What are you doing here? Mr. Mr. Jones ran out of diesel again. The ghost, the ghost? That's what Mr. Turvey told me. It guards the tree of life in Tawny Hour. Tree of life? What's that? Oh, it's it's this tree. It's supposed to keep you forever young. Really? You gather the leaves when they're lit by moonbeams, and they keep you young forever. Well, the thing that keeps me young is a good night's sleep. And it's about time I was off home. See ya. Bye, Stan. Tree of life, eh? People pay good money for something like that. Well, Walter, how about a moonlight expedition to Tawny Owl Wood? Yeah. Tell you what, I'll just nip back, tell Nicola I'm out for the evening, we'll go and have a look, see, eh? But you better watch out for the ghosts! <laughs> ghosts? <laughs> the boy's got a point. We'd better keep our eyes peeled. Yeah. No, oh, oh, I've not found half Elsie's washing yet, and it's getting dark. Oh, ow! Oh, 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 my foot! Stupid tree stump! Ow! Oh, 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 ah, ow! You okay, Walter? You got everything? Nice big bag for the leaves. Check. Torch. Check. Anti ghost powder. Anti ghost powder. Yeah, and it must be good too. You seen any ghosts? 
<laughs> Very amusing, Walter. Now, best foot forward and let's find that tree of life. Which way now? Well, according to what Thomas told me, um, that way. <clears throat> I think. <laughs> what was that? Ah, don't do that, Mr. Jones. Did you hear it? Hear yeah, what? <laughs> that. Well, it's just a badger or something. Come on, Mr. Jones, nothing to be scared of. Scared? Who's scared? Uh, uh, scared? There! Look over there, Walter! The Tree of Life! Oh, yeah! Aye, it does look sort of magic. Right, let's get harvesting. Ha! Ha ha! There it is again! It's. Ha ha! It's the ghost! The ghost! <laughs> <laughs> it's the ghost! It's the ghost! <laughs> which, which way? Where, where did we, we come from? What are we... Mr. Jones? Mr. Jones? Are you down there? Yes, of course I'm down here, and it's too deep to climb out of. Get help quickly before the ghost finds me and and oh, just help. The ghost? Oh, yeah, I, I'll go and get a rope or something, and I'll be right back. You 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 stay where you are. Stay where you are, he said. Ha! Stan, Stan, come quick. Walter, is that you? Stan, you, you got help. It's, it's Mr. Jones. He's, he's fallen down a hole, and, 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 and there's a ghost. Calm down. Come inside and tell me all about it. No, 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 no. There's no time for that. You've got to come and, and, and bring little red tractor and a rope. <laughs> a ghost? Are you sure? I saw it with my own eyes, Stan. All white and ghostly. Mr. Jones? Stan, is that you? Yes, hang on. We've come to get you out. Thank goodness the ghost could be back at any moment. Grab hold of this. Grab hold of what? Ouch! Careful! Sorry. OK, Walter. Now watch out for Mr. Jones. That's it. Keep him coming, little red tractor. Now steady. Steady. There. We've done it, Stan. Oh, thank you, Stan. Thanks, little red tractor. Now let's get out of here before the ghost. <laughs> ah, it's back. It's back. It's, it's, it's here. Stumpy. Hello, Stan. <laughs> what are you doing here? Stumpy! Oh, hello, Mr. Jones. Oh, you wouldn't believe the time I've had of it been searching all over Elsie's laundry. Stumpy toe, too. Oh, and the noises I've heard tonight. Enough to turn your hair white. <laughs> if it weren't white already, that is. <laughs> what there is of... Oh, uh, what the... What? What? Have I done something I shouldn't? Am I glad to be home? And first thing in the morning, I'll be around to stump his mill to give him a piece of my mind. Another piece? I think you gave him quite enough back there in the woods. It wasn't his fault you decided to go ghost hunting in the... 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 Mr. Jones. Something the matter? Uh, it's a go... it's a go... go a go... go ah! A ghost? Uh, don't think so. It's the corn dolly. And your headlights are casting a shadow on the barn wall, little red tractor. Hold on. Did you do that on purpose? <laughs> oh, you.